All right, first things first, let's revive Funk. Wait, where was the church? Oh, this is the church right here, duh. Yes, Funky died. Now I must resurrect. I have 5,000 gold now. I'm tempted to use it on stuff. You've never played Final Fantasy 1 through 3, Drew? Then if you do that, you should play the Pixel remasters that just came out. Because that means you can play the original versions with updated... Like, the original versions graphically, but with updated mechanics and quality of life stuff, which is nice. Because I've heard there's some pretty good improvements in the remakes, that the Pixel remakes that are nice. And the music I heard is pretty good too, like the the remastered music. G -g -g Goddess, fever few seeds at last! Quickly now, you must sow them in the soil here. They shan't take too long to grow. Wow, they just grow instantly? Sweet. Jesus, they literally grow instantly. Hurry, plant them, they're done. Fever few shoots start popping up all over the place as, someone, as everyone looks on in disbelief. Thank you, my lady, you've saved the empire. I should like you to take a few take a fever few root with you as a trophy of this most auspicious occasion sweet that's exactly all I needed gotta heal a motherfucker so far FF1 and FF2 pixel remaster are pretty much the same as the original as far as gameplay goes and expect 3 to be the same gameplay yes Drew I mean X gamer but they do have quality of life stuff for like you know things that you, you move a lot faster it's not as slow as it was on the NES version the music's rearranged uh, the um, there was another thing too and I'm pretty sure there's some like specific like battle <laughs> like certain areas where battles were kind of ridiculous before are not as bad anymore like I I know particularly in the first game there's a hallway where there's a lot of encounters somebody said it wasn't quite as bad it was still a lot of encounters but not as many that's what I've been told. I have no proof. I haven't seen it. Just what I've been told. It's just disappointing that the extra stuff found in the GBA version aren't included. I'm okay with that. Because they would have had to remake the whole, those whole parts of those games into pixel versions. I'm okay with them not remaking those. Because those aren't even part of the PSP versions either. Those are only on GBA. I don't remember which part in FF1 it is, Flitcher. If it's the Hall of Giants, then maybe. I just remember there was a particular hallway where you fight a battle like every step. And apparently that's not the case anymore. Apparently. I don't know that for sure. And yeah, you're definitely getting pretty close to finishing Final Fantasy VI there, Drew. I'm, I'm pretty hyped for your finishing that up. I've already been left in charge here, you know. There ain't no stopping me now. Y'all have a safe trip now, you hear? Wow. That dude's already running the place. Crazy. The Serena returned not long ago. She didn't seem very happy, I have to say. I wonder if her companion's health has deteriorated. It must be a terrible worry for her. Is Kiri all dead? Am I laid? I don't... I don't believe. You people, you have few, few, few root? I went to place, but I could not find nothing. I abandoned my hopes, but now I am so much happy. Hurry, you must give to fever few root to root at Kiriel. Wow. Give it at him. Hurry, you must give fever fuel root at Kirill. Uh, I will give him. I will give it at him. Give it at him. Maya mashes up the fever fuel root and feeds it to Kirill. The color comes back into Kirill's cheeks almost instantaneously, and he suddenly recovers. Uh. Uh. Uh-oh, Sorevna Elena, you are here? Thank to the goddess, you are woken again. Waken again. You are waken again. I am so very much ashamed, my duty. It was for protecting you, but, uh... Never mind anymore, Kirill. We must continue to our voyage and locate the Sorrow the Manslayer. <gasps> what you are saying? Oh, you are also searching this Sorrow Manslayer? It appears the village Funky G is living in previously suffered attack by the Sorrow. Perhaps it would be wise if... I have idea. We must travel together. The more people we are, the merrier we are. More party members. Oh, 
All right. Your new two members' possessions are placed in the bag. Sweet. They hurry outside to wait in the wagon. Bitchin'. I have so many choices now. I'm so glad we have four party members at least, though. Oh, what's happening? Wait a minute. I know I shouldn't have been listening in, but I'm afraid I couldn't help myself. It sounds like we have the heroine who will save the world among us, the great Funky G. That chap who was staying here before, Ragnar McRyan, said something about how he was looking for a heroine. If my memory serves me correctly, he was off to Palais de Lyon, way over in Libereccio to the west, or Le Lebecchio. All right, so that's the last guy we need to get back in the party from the beginning of the game. Also, holy crap, I didn't read this book. There's a book entitled My Quest for the Magical Staff, Chapter 3. I am Rowan the Wandering Wandsman. I now find myself in a town rumored to have links to the magical staff I'm searching for. I asked around the moment I arrived to see if the townsfolk knew where I could find it. Unfortunately, my journey isn't over yet. It seems that an object of my quest isn't here to town after all. No, apparently it's in a cave nearby. I ask you, whatever the world is coming to, why ever do you insist people on hiding such precious things in caves of all places? Now I'm in a real fix. There's nothing I loathe and detest more than caves, and that's a fact. All right, then. So we got to go find my boy Ragnar. That's our last character to re recruit to be in the party. What I am considering right now is maybe we're going to go all girls right now. We really don't need this many mages. I could use somebody who's a little more physical and punchy. I'd be down to use uh, my girl Elena right now. Oh, wait. Sorry. Got to put him in order. Uh... Do, 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 do. Oh, she has way more defense. Why don't I put her in front? I'm stupid of me before. All right, that'll be better. Let's go with that. Tell Alina catches up in level a little bit. We'll try that out. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. What? No, no, no. Hold up. Bitch. There we go. So anyway, let me um, answer your question there, Drew. You have the GBA versions of the games, but the Pixel remasters are so much better you'll buy them. So here's the thing, Drew. If you want to play... Final Fantasy 1 through 3 in their original form, but in an updated version that's easier to play, then play the Pixel Remasters. If you want to play them with a little bit updated graphics and slightly extra content, at least for Final Fantasy 1 and 2, then just play the GBA version. For Final Fantasy 3, I recommend the Pixel Remaster unless you want to play the remake one that's completely remade in 3D graphics. But if you want the old Final Fantasy 3, the original version, then grab the pixel version that just came out. But for Final Fantasy 1, if you want extra content, and Final Fantasy 1 and 2, then the GBA one has extra content. But I'm assuming that the pixel versions are going to have better music than the GBA version. Because the GBA version is going to have Game Boy, you know, music. Think about it that way. It's got the Game Boy, like, however you call it, the Game Boy sound, sound board or sound, sound sounds. Um, is this where I could buy more weapons? Because I was going to buy some better stuff. So, nobody can use the Holy Lance. Because I had an extra one. Kyriel already has one too, though. See, everybody already got one. I'm just going to buy the armor instead. The only thing worth buying is that Coterie Sword, so I'm just going to buy armor instead. I'm going to get a full play armor for Funky. She's the only one who could wear it, so let's just buy it. Can't carry more than reorganize. I don't care for shit. Iron Apron can go Tornico. I just took off an iron armor. I can give that to Curiel if I, if I want to, though. Iron Shield I can buy for Funk. And Mina. Golden Tiara. If I buy an Iron Helmet, I won't need a Tiara. I'm going to buy the Iron Helmet for Funk as well. On your last playthrough of Dragon Quest IV, you got shocked and you won a Holy Lance during Elena's chapter? Damn. That sounds pretty sweet. 1 in 128 drop. That's pretty good. That's pretty lucky. So I have an extra one of these I can give to Mina, or Elena for that matter. I'm probably going to give it to Elena, actually. I should buy another one for Mina. Damn. 
I need a lot of these things still. I guess I could take the Iron Shield off of Curio and Tornico and just be like, fuck you, I'm not using you right now. I could do that. Because I can actually go through their items, which is pretty nice. Give that to her. It's actually a pretty nice menu to move items around for all your characters. I like this. Alright, that's good. If only you could get that lucky in Earthbound. Are there some good early drops in Earthbound that you could get if you get lucky? Is that what we're implying right now? I'm gonna give this a mean uh, to Elena rather. I think everybody has. Nobody can use the scale shield. I don't think. Oh, wait. Oh yeah, I can give this to Kirill now that he doesn't have a shield. Uh, iron armor. Can anyone use this? That that'll actually help them. I can give it to Kirill. I can give it to Kirill. Okay, Kirill, you can have the iron armor. It's your lucky day, sir. All right, scale shield. I have an extra one. I can give that to uh, Tornico for now. Anything else extra? Scale shield, Holy Lance. Nobody can use that thing, huh? Got this extra Holy Lance that no one can use. I'm just going to sell it. Because two people who can't use it already have one. I don't think anyone's gonna be able to use this feathered cap either. Bronze armor, no. Leather armor, no one cares. All right, yeah, we're gonna sell the rest. I'm just gonna sell the rest of these extra things right now. Get them out of my life. Extra holy lance. See ya. Mainly for the extra money, more than anything. But also to make the space, just so I don't have to see it anymore, you know. I know we still gotta get Ragnar back, but none of this stuff is gonna be for Ragnar. Only the Holy Lance, maybe, but I think by the point, point we get him, we'll get a better Lance for him. I would hope. Or a better weapon, even if it's not a Lance. He might even be able to use the Broadsword, actually, so that's technically better, I think, too. Alright. I think I sold everything I wanted to sell that was in people's inventories. I have some stuff in here we can get rid of. I have two of these? Alright. I have a seed of magic I left in the inventory as well. Figure out what I want to do with that. Who do I want to put a MP boost on right now? Probably main character again, honestly. Yeah. No, it did it again. Damn it. Why does it keep doing that? Stop doing that. Okay, well this time it didn't freeze my OBS. It just froze my stream again. What is causing that? I don't understand. I closed Discord, so it wasn't Discord. Is it the fucking... I, don't, I gotta figure out what's causing that flutter. That's so annoying. Anyway, hopefully you guys are still seeing me a lot live and all that good stuff. No wonder Kiro got sick in the first place. He's been carrying some shit the whole time. I know, right? He's been got that goddamn manure in his inventory. You guys can still see me, that's good. 
maybe 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 it is just my my uh my actual browser crashed of the actual stream maybe it's literally just google chrome crashing it could be which is stupid i don't really need to be watching my google chrome anyways yesterday was a windows update day it was i did do a windows update today so that would be annoying here's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna just pause my stream i don't need to see my stream we'll see if that helps all right no sorry flitchard um i moved past the place where i missed some missed a random piece of dialogue now you can tell me what i missed then that's fine no, it's okay. I don't want to restart the stream if I don't have to. I think what it is, it's it's either OBS or it's or it's Google Chrome, which I had my stream open on. Like it, basically, what's happening is it's crashing, and then like it, my my stream was frozen on my end. All right. Anyway, uh, I am going. To, I'm leaving. I can just go on my ship and get the fuck out of here now. So let's get the fuck out of here, shall we? Oh, you know what? No, fuck that. X marks the spot, bitch. Let's go. Hold on. There's a place that you can go with a big red X on the map. I'm going to check that shit out right now, though. All right. The enemy didn't notice my presence. Fuck him up, then. So Elena is super fast. She actually went first. She's pretty, she's pretty fast, which is nice. All right. So this is the... Oh, it's a teleport place. If you travel a long way southeast of here, you come to the Empire of Parthenia. Yeah, I've been there. So I need the key to open that one. Both of them. So the X marks the spot place is just for a fucking, like, teleport house? No, it's not. No, it's not. That's actually further up. Oh, I don't think I can get there. Oh. I don't think I can get in there. You know I like the way you sizzle, baby. Hold up. Let me attack the single one first. The group can get fucked up separately. Burn, baby, burn. Burn those mushies. Burn, baby, burn. Burn those mushies down. Oh my god, just die, you fuck. Piece of, piece of fuck. I don't know if that was a serious thing you're telling me to buy or not, Resin, but because I don't have a boomerang at my availability yet. If that's actually a thing, I don't know where that's it. Oh, did I see your message about the joke, Flitchard? Uh, I can see it if I go back and talk to King of Parthenia at night. Okay. I could do that. I'm kind of heading that direction right now because I'm double checking that I can't actually go in the middle of this area. Making sure there's not just like some mountains I can walk over in this general area. And if not, I'll teleport over there. Making sure this is fully surrounded by mountains. I think it probably is, but let's make sure. It would be weird that I found a treasure map and I'd be able to get there immediately. Do, 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 do. Ooh, who went up a level now? That would be funky. Hell yeah. And I learned evac. Sweet. So now I have evac on a, on a character I'm using because I had it on Borea, but wasn't using him. All right, so this actually looks blocked all the way down. Oh, I wonder if I could have gone around and then walked up. Or maybe not. 
Actually, I don't think so. I think it's all blocked by mountain. Or maybe not. I'm not sure. Anyway, let me stop here real quick. Actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I could make a night. I have a night light. Let's just make it night real quick. I'll talk to the king since I'm here, Flitchard. Might as well get the little silly dialogue you want to see me see. me see. That's fine. Not a big deal. Is he down here still? Or is he, he must be back in his... He must be back to ruling. Wow. Uh... You said King of Parthenia at night. He's sleeping. I don't... I don't get it. I mean, I, I've seen that already. He said, ah, few, ah, few, few. He said that before I went to the dungeon. I already read... I already saw that, Fletcher. I already saw that, actually. So, basically, yeah. I already saw that. All right, so I don't think I'll just finish walking back. Hold up. Let me attack the rat first. And I'll sizzle the rest of these fuckers. Be careful. You might get caught in a loop reading his name. Rat attack, rat attack, rat attack, tag, tag, rat attack, 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 rat attack. I'm infinite looping. Rat attack, rat attack, I'll stop. I'll stop. Okay, so now we've seen the rest of this continent. Let's get the fuck out of here. We can't f we can't go there without being able to fly or some other way to get in there. I'm assuming we'll be able to get an airship or some other way to fly. Fly on the dragon. Hey, better watch out. Ratata might sue somebody. Ratata ta 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 ta. Fuck him up. We good. All right, let's pop a quick heal on Elena. Oh, that's Maya. Sorry. Let's just pop a heal on her regardless. All right. Let's get on that boat. After one more fight. Oh, my God. So many rat attacks. So many rats. Damn it. It's going to take a sizzle to finish him off, unfortunately. That's fine, though. I'm not on a boat yet, but I will be. Now I'm on a boat. Don't you ever forget. Okay, so in terms of the map... The world map. We still have quite a few little sections I haven't been to yet. Had to sizzle them. Hate to do it. You hate to do it. But you love to hate to do it. I'm kind of tempted to check out all these little areas on the map I haven't been. Just to see what's there. Okay, so this... Oh, I was about to say, can I cross this? No. Okay, so this place is surrounded by rocks. But all that's here is like a poison... I was wondering if we were going to have battles in the water. I was a little like, is there going to be battles? There is. Fuck you, man of war. You fucked. You heal slime palette swap. All right, so there's that. I'm going to check out the continent in the south right now. Why is there always one tiny continent two years from everywhere? It's just, it's just how worlds are built, man. All right, so this, this is probably... What? What the fuck? I was not expecting to go into a map with the boat. What the fuck? For real? 
that's pretty cool. Can I get off here? Hello? Hello? Can't get off at the thing, but I can get off on the fucking grass, okay? Back in the old days, people used to fly about in the sky in funny contraptions they built. But that all ended when the Lord of the Underworld went on and made it with the basic ingredient, if you like. The basic ingredient, if you like. I reckon it probably ended up being sealed away within with him, you know? Probably. Secret ingredient, you say? Well, welcome to the place. Welcome to Boatland, suck a fool! People reckon there's a monster castle somewhere in the Ostro Outback. No one's been enough of a gal to go and find out if it's true or not, though. Haha. -ha. A gala? I don't know. Gala? Gala. What do you sell here? Medican. Nothing I need. Oh. It's like an Australian accent. I see. I don't really have an Australian accent. Welcome to the weapon shop. What do we got? Battle axe. Ooh. Dream blade. Double. Ooh. Dragon's bane. Triple. Ooh. I don't have money for any of that, but goddamn. God, this... This emulator don't like this area, I guess. Maybe it's the water? I don't know. It's chugging a little bit on this area. Gala. Don't be such a gala. Dum, 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 dum. Can I talk to this guy? Welcome to the Riverside Town of Riverton. Pretty good name for this place, eh? Hey, that boat you got is a real beaut. Good on you. It's good on you, mate. Still, I suppose you need a size thing if you're sailing out on the open ocean. I don't have an I don't I, I don't have an Australian accent. I'd have to practice it. I truly don't have even a slightest clue how to do one at the top of my head. It's all the advanced water physics and fish AI, exactly. Killing emulator. I'll be stuffed. I didn't think anyone would find me here. This is the secret fishing spot, see? And I'd like to keep it that way. Don't tell anyone, right? Wait, you don't have an Australian accent? No. Basically, it's an exaggerated Cockney one. Yeah, my Cockney one's not very good either. And I don't really watch Crocodile Dundee. Dundee? 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 So, I don't have an accent for that guy either. You can call that a knife. A knife ya. Damn, they have good shit here, dude. Nah, Dundee is probably more like Dundee. Dundee. Damn, they have some good ass shit here, though. Damn, and it's all mostly for Funky, too. The Funky Australian, that's my new name, exactly. The Magical Vest is pretty good. Man, I don't want to spend all my money on any of this right now. It's so good, too. Damn. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. Especially on the off chance that I find any of that stuff randomly. So I'm gonna do an NYC accent. That's definitely one. I definitely have to hear it to replicate it. I can't... Some accents, you can't really do it unless you hear it, so you can practice it. That's pretty much my move. I have a hard time even trying to do an accent off the top of my head if it's not one I've done a lot. So I have to actually, like, hear it and try to replicate it. That's the way you do it. Oi noi! Hooly dooly! I can hardly believe my eyes, you know. There's a humongo, humongo statue to the south of this river in Struth. I swear I saw it go walkabout. Fair dink. Fair dink. It's just gonna be the fucking terrible Irish accent I, was, I usually do. Top of the morning do ya! <laughs> Gold Bracer. Let's see. What is that for? Uh, okay. Shit, everyone can use this. 
I'm just gonna let Funky wear it for now, and if it, anyone else wants to use it later, they can. Does that replace the shield? It does not, it's just its own thing. Okay. It's like an accessory, I guess. So, once we get more accessories, we'll probably have to move them around. But for now, that goes on the Funkster. All right, we didn't check out this house yet. Traveling around the world, are ya? How'd you like a stump up? Wait, how'd you like to stump up from your flying machine to help you on your way? Yes, please. There's only one slight problem. It ain't finished yet. All I need is a gas. That's lighter than air, though. And then I reckon she'll fly. Um, helium? Do you need helium? There don't seem to be any particularly interesting books. Rip. Too easy. Too easy. Now I'm doing Yogi Bear. Oi! Don't touch my picnic basket! <laughs> hey, boo boo! Uh, don't touch my picnic basket! <laughs> Alright, where's this gonna take me, I wonder? Donde a star will you take me, motherfucker? Oh, it's behind the locked door, of course it is, motherfucker. But at least now I know. Why would you even need that? Maybe there's a reason for that later, like if we get stranded somewhere. Which now that I said that is probably gonna happen. All right, what's up with this big ass statue looking thing? They said it was walking around, right? Didn't somebody in town say it was they saw it walking around? Had a walkabout or something like that. It is said that the Colossus catches the teardrops from that fall from its eyes. Good luck on your quest, my children. Wow, okay. Thank you for all the tips and tricks. Don't go picking my basket or I'm gonna blow my gasket. Blow up my gasket. Also, damn it, I don't have the key for that shit. Damn it. When the hell are we gonna get the next key? The other freaking Dragon Quest games, you found the keys so quickly. At least I feel like most of them you did. I don't know if it was every game. But the keys were like the biggest progress makers in the early part of the game. All the And all the Dragon Quest games I already played. Oh, that's the Yogi Bear line. Don't go pick it up my basket or I'm gonna blow up your gasket. Is that a line that he says? Also, holy shit, they hit hard. I need to get the fuck out of here. I came to the wrong place first, y'all. Maybe I should leave. This is unsafe. This is unsafe. I can't even believe I defeated one of them. I just want to run away at this point, honestly. Those fuckers are too strong. God damn. Uh, where was the inn? There was an inn, right? Maybe not. I don't remember. Was any of these the inn? This one. Wake up, bitch! I need a bed! Got my ass handed to me. I don't like it. Heal me. Bet I can also do a Fred Flintstone. Bonnie. <laughs> Wilma. I haven't heard I haven't heard Fred Flintstone's voice in so long. I I couldn't even tell you. All right, where the fuck am I going? I already forgot where I wanted to go. Can I look around on this map? Yeah, I remember the Wilma thing. Wilma! Can I, can I like look around on this map at all? I did sing a dinosaur song yesterday. I did. 
I did. D I N O S A, you are a dinosaur. Louder and fatter. Well, bah. I don't think it's that deep. And it was the best. Well, you're the one that requested the song, Maro, so hopefully you're the one enjoy enjoyed it at least. Because I imagine the people choose the songs for their own enjoyment first, and anybody else's enjoyment second. Wow, these things are very high defense. Who went up? Elena? No, I didn't even catch who went up. Oh, that was Curiel that went up a level. Nice. He learned Fizzle. Fizzle, fizzle, baby. You also loved Captain Caveman? I don't know if I know Captain Caveman there, Frog. I know I've heard the name, but I don't think I've ever watched it. Dude, could you not? I'm actually just going to keep exploring all these parts I haven't been to. The grayed out parts of the map. I forget where they said, uh, what's his face went. Ragnar. He went to... Uh, the, the Italian sounding place, right? Leon de whatever. I forgot the name of it. Malruses? I'm scared. These guys are gonna be hella strong. I'm scared. I'm so scared. Oof. They're not as strong as those fucking pterodactyl things, but they're still pretty damn strong. They have way more HP. Holy shit. Malruses, I know, right? What a name. Let's go to the Malrus today. God, these things have hell HP. My God. Why the hell would you use your magic on the other one? Dude, die. What is happening? How much HP do y'all fucks have? Seriously. Any relation to Marl Burrows? No, it's not spelled the same way. It's actually spelled like Maul, but they're Maulrus. Dude, these guys are way too fucking strong for their own good. My god. That was absurd. Boria learned Acceleratal. Tornico went up. Nice. Yes, exactly. Spelled exactly like that, Frog. It's interesting because everybody else has been to these other places. But apparently not... Uh... To the point where uh, I can actually teleport everywhere I've been before, which is kind of weird. Also, there is a fucking town here, too. What is this town? Hello? Ahoy there, me hearty. We don't often folk around... We don't often get folk around these parts. I don't suppose you know the legend of the sands of time, do ya? Yo ho ho! Well, that'd be surprising. Oh, these are fucking pirates. Ahoy there, me hearty. <laughs> we don't often get folk around these parts. I don't suppose you know the legend of the sands of time, do ya? Oh, wait, I should say no, sorry. The sands of time be a curious treasure with the power to turn back time. If you had a thing like that in battle, it could make a difference between life on the fiddler's green. <laughs> oh, also, he had a thing to look at. Hold on. Hey, we got a free hat that I can sell. Sweet. Did I check this? No. Yes, maybe. I don't know. Arr. Okay, there's also an inn here, surprisingly. Oh, it is nighttime. Let's look around at night before we make it daytime. There are shops here, too. Okay. Ahoy! When night falls and the tide comes in, the beach be covered in water. There's also a fucking whirlpool in the water. Okay. When the sea's rough, the wind starts to sound like people's voices. 
It's like hearing our ancestors calling to us from down in Davy Jones' locker. Ooh, back door. <laughs> My old man's a bilge drinking scallywag he is. All he ever be doing is sleeping. Off you. Off you. Arf you, arf you. That's the sound they make when they sleep. Off you, off you. No, off you! <laughs> Arr, my husband's a traitor, and he knows all there is to know about items. Well, then let's talk to him about it. Are ye the wench who wants to know about the sands of time? Legend has it that our ancestors used it during their swashbuckling battles. Seems the sands of time could be used to turn back time if your previous attack were scuppered. I suppose folk managed to get by without it, but it'd be a useful thing to have, that's for sure. Indeed it would. <laughs> I haven't had to break out the pirate voice in a while. It took me a second to kind of get it going. Anyway, let me check down the well, and then I'll make it daytime. Nothing? Nobody? Oh! I lied. Mini metal. Ooh. And some fishnet stockings. Okay. 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 I like what I'm seeing. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. So, can we only have one accessory per person? I'm assuming that's the case. Yes. Okay. So, what do they do? The ultimate sexy leg wear. Ooh. Okay. I wonder if only girls can wear it. Yep, only girls. Racist. Oh, damn. It actually makes the defense bump pretty good, though. I'm going to give those to... Uh... Wow. I'm going to give those to Maya, I think. Ale actually, better on Maya or one of the other girls because they have lower defense. Elena actually has better defense than the other girls. She's lower level, but she's already got higher defense now, so... Yeah. I need to hit up a fucking, um, I need to find a, a church so I can revive my dead girl, damn it. Dude, dude, curious looking book without a title. Funky G takes it from the shelf and reads it. I try to run away, but feel my clothes being torn at. I'm pulled back sharply and I fall to the ground. Once more, I try to escape, but those arms like tree trunks engulf me and steal away my freedom. I cry out in agony. Forgive me, Barbara. I promise I'll never be unfaithful again. But she just squeezes those arms tighter around me, unforgiving, relentless. And as my consciousness fades, I make the decision to break up with her once and for all. I'm sorry, Barbara. I'll never come for you again. This here is Dun Plundering. <laughs> the name of this town is Dun Plundering. That's the best name I've ever heard in my life. Dun plundering. That's incredible. All right, so they sell a cloak of evasion here, which is pretty dang good. I'm tempted to buy that for Elena right now. I think I will. Where do you go when you're done plundering? To the island of Dun plundering, of course. Of course. Duh. Our ancestors be pirates are, and but when one day they gave up the sweet trade and set home set up home here, and they left their booty hidden in a, in a waterfall somewhere in this big wide world. Folks say they're a liquid metal sword is among in amongst their loot too. Are a liquid metal sword is in behind a waterfall. Noted. We used to have a karstway stone here in our village, Arr. If you dropped it into the sea, the water around it would dry up just like that. Speaking of the water drying up, did the water tide go out? 
I think the tide went out, which is interesting. During the day, during the night, the tide is in. During the day, the tide's out. That's kind of cool. These are the graves of our ancestors. Gentlemen of fortune, they were. Oh, okay then. Pirates. When the tide comes in at night, the gravestones are swallowed up by water, just like a Davy Jones locker. Doom, 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 doom. So the idea is that they were ancestors of pirates, thus they're not plundering anymore. It all makes sense. Ah, oh, musk. Its scent will attract monsters for a while until it runs out. I'm good. I have whistle. That's good enough. All right. I guess we're done here and done plundering for now. I'm done plundering and done plundering. Now that I know what it's about, I guess we'll be back if I ever need to some other day. Do, 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 do. Lethal armors and rhinothropes. The rhinothropes actually look pretty hilarious, I'm not gonna lie. Curial. Wow, he's actually same level as Elena, but doing less damage. Damn, these rhinos hit hard, man. Scared. They hit real hard. I don't like it. Oh, the one that died is the one that he... Oh, I have it backwards. I thought the girl who died was the one that did all the magic. I was wrong. The one who does the healing is the one that died. Never mind. I was mistaken. We got out of there alive. That's all that matters. Do I not know the Brick House song? Uh, you mean, cause she's a brick. House. Dun, 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 dun. She's mighty, mighty, and lets them all hang out. You mean that song? Of course I know that song. <laughs> what town? Oh, 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 this is the, uh, this is the mines. This is not a town. Although I could, was there, oh, there was a church here, wasn't there? I think so. Yeah. Let me, let me revive, uh, Mina real quick. I don't, I mean, I guess I could save it. I didn't mean to, but I'll do it anyways. I'll make a save state while I'm at it. I haven't done that in like in probably almost an hour. No, I quit the game. At least I saved it. If I wouldn't have saved it and I did that, I'd be pissed right now. Oh, I have to reset. Oops. Well, shit. I'm a dumb. Did you have a peaceful respite? Did ya? Did ya? Right, let's survive my girl, Mina. I've been wasting so much damn money on reviving people, it sucks. I keep going to high level places accidentally though, so it's that's part on me. All right, let me change the lineup. Boom. Yeah, you have the higher defense, so boom that. She has 60, this girl can be in the back. There you go. All right, let me make a save stay real quick. All right. Okay, so that's that place. Have I been to this little spot over here on the edge over here? Have I been to this cave? Have I been here? Also, I have the wagon with me. What the heck? 
Secret alchemist laboratory, but there's no way to get further down the cave. All I know is that there's some switch at the bottom of a treasure chest somewhere that's... Oh, I've not been here. I don't want to go in here, do I? All right, it all depends on how hard these enemies are. The flamethrower is... We fought that in a boss fight earlier. I wonder how hard this is going to be. Let's see. Okay, these are actually not hard. I haven't been here, though, right? I don't remember this treasure chest at the bottom of a thing. Oh, if the cave entrance is wide enough, that's how the wagon gets in? That's an interesting tidbit to know. It's good to know, actually. Also, level up for Mina. Need to heal Maya real quick. She hurting a little bit. She hurting. All right. I guess... Oh, we have been here. Wait. Is there a secret here that I missed? Or maybe I haven't been here. Now I'm just going to check. Because now I'm just like, what? There's a, there's a secret here, though? According to the guy in the entrance, there is. I'm going to look around. I don't remember there being anything about an alchemist here. I'm going to take a look here. I can always evac out of here. I was like, this place looks familiar. I'm pretty sure I have been here. Yeah, I remember these elevators. But, like, I don't remember anything about finding something at the bottom of a treasure chest. I definitely don't remember that. Maybe it's an extra secret. I'm going to look into it since I heard about it now. Yeah, okay, I know this place. Some buffalo wild wings appear. Fuck them up. I'm hungry. Boy, we hungry. That'd be great if I can get some better weapons for Elena. We already know we can buy some sick weapons for Funky. But they're expensive as shit. I don't remember the path through here. So I'm just going to follow the first, path, the first path I see and hope for the best. Is this the dungeon where we were with the, the purple hair girls? Yeah, it is. Where we met up with Ooh 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 Jam. Now I remember. Oh Oh Jam. You can't summon a dragon, Dragon Pup. That's not cool. That's super uncool of you. It's the uncoolest. Fuck it, just attack. Oh, these are the Flying Doctors. I remember them now. They wrecked me in that tower dungeon, but they should be weak sauce for me now. Hey, who went up a level this time? Elena, that's who I would like to go up level since we're using her. But the chest is empty. There's a switch! Hit it! Yeah! Secrets! Okay, I'm gonna... Ooh... I don't know if there's going to be fights down here, but I'm going to heal just in case. I should have used mid-heal, but oh well. Oh, I can't go through here, can I? Oh yeah, I can because I have the key. Sick. My quest for the magical staff, chapter 4. Funky G takes it from the shelf and reads it. I am Rowan, the wandering wandsman. I'm not happy about it in the slightest, but work is work, so I must venture to that cave. It seems that in order to find the magical staff, I must locate the treasure chest in the deepest part of the cave and examine the bottom of it. Of all the places in the deepest part of the cave, I ask you, somebody up there must really hate me. Oh dear, I'm getting quite agitated by the whole thing. Once I find this magical staff, I think it might be time for career change. Maybe I'll go back to my hometown and use what little savings I have to start some kind of business. It's about time I did what I wanted for a change. Is this where the staff is? Am I here? We might be. Hey, a mini metal. Let's go. Hey, a free seat of magic. Let's go. And hey, a magical key. A magic key? Huh. What kind of doors do that open? Maybe that's the kind of key we need to open up all the doors I've been stuck on. 
Can open complicated locks. Interesting. Complicated locks. I wonder if that just opens up all the locks I haven't been able to open this whole time. I don't remember there being any other kinds of locks. Anyway, I don't need to walk back out of here. Let's just zoom, zoom, or evac and zoom. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Make my heart go boom, boom, my supernova girl. I'm trying to visit everywhere that I have been, just in case, you know, for the teleports. So this should be where the, yeah, the girl, the dancing girls came from. Wait, this, wait, 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 is this, this actually might be where Ragnar is. I forget the name of this place, but this might be the place. Let me look around. Uh, oh, yeah, this was like French accent. Thanks to that ridiculous monster foolery, the dancing girls do not perform so much these days. I live for them to think I will not see them pass by here every day. No, it is more than a man can bear. More than a man can bear. <laughs> Nothing to the doing today either. Artois wouldn't give me a job again. Surely I'll get my big break soon. You know the grand debut. I, this accent is falling apart on me, dude. I need somebody who actually has the words that go with the accent to do it. Oh, okay. Tornico can actually appraise items. That's right. So if I have an item I don't know what to do with, I'll check with him. Our piece de resistance on stage this evening is the great comedian Tom Foolery. Airy for your pleasure and delight. The stage is at the bottom of the stairs. Then I'm going to go check it shit out, bitch. Wait, hold on. Maya Moshari, oh la la, I am over the moon to see you again. Et bien, tell me how the, goes the vengeance of your father's tragic death. I see, but well, do not give up hope, my fille. my fille. Zoot, everything was going so well, but they don't want me now. As dancing girls, we are not a, not a la mode anymore. No a la mode. They just want comedians, bitch. Playboy bunnies aren't where it's at anymore. We want funny. What's up, dude? Ah, would you look at that? Come to see the show, have you? I've just been telling me favorite jokes, so I have. You didn't miss the punchline, did you? Kippers to king slimes, did you get it? Ha <laughs> ha, I cracked myself up. Sometimes I really do. Wow. Listen to that crowd go wild. Kippers to cling king slips. So funny. Dude, everyone is here, though. Look at this fucking crowd. Good damn. No, I was laughing. Oh, I was laughing so hard I flapped out my five teeth. Haha, <laughs> by the god, is that Tom Fuller? He's the funniest man in the world. Haha, <laughs> I almost got that one. They say laughter is the key to longevity. We'll see. I paid a small fortune for this spot. I'm gonna get my money's worth. Don't talk to me now. I'm trying to listen. Hey, it's my, isn't it? I heard you'd give it up here, but you're back, are you? Woohoo, that's great. What? I didn't catch that. I can't hear over all the laughter. It's so funny. What? With the ticket and few drinks and snacks, it's a whole day's pay gone. Just like that. Sorry to talk to him. That was a funny one. I'll have to remember that. Ah, uh, ah, uh, 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 No, no more. It hurts. It hurts. It's the way the geezer tells him. Even if you've heard it before, that Tom Fooleries can still make you larf. No, I'd almost memorize the steps of that cobra dance when this comedian came along and ousted all the dancing girls off stage. Mind you, he's pretty funny. I must try to remember some of his jokes. Listening to a few jokes over a good long drink. Nope, doesn't get any better than this. Let me tell you what. Came all the way from the Bonnie, my Bonnie homeland of Berlin to see the lovely wee dancing lassie, Maya. But now I find that she, oop, I find out that she didn't, didn't work here anymore. Folks say she's flipped off somewhere else. Look at all the faces here. Hasn't anyone got any more important things to do? I was an imbecile to buy such a cheap ticket. I cannot get a view from back here. Ho ho he ho hoo, mon dieu. Uh, no more, my sides are gonna burst. I heard this man was very droll, so I came to see for myself. It's true, he is hilarious. Okay. That was a lot of people to talk to. I was not expecting that many people. Jeebus. 
but that's basically everybody in town is here. Alchemy? Yes, I've heard of it. It's a long... It's a way of turning iron into gold, isn't it? It is. It's a way. Away, away. A nice cold drink after a work is just a ticket. You can't top it. You came... You came over here over the ocean? Then you will have seen the rocky island where the monsters live, no? Yes. No one has ever come back alive from that place. It is best to observe it from afar. That... <laughs> Lord of the Under... Uh, Lord of the Under... Zyble, uh, no. Lord of the Underworld. Yeesh. He hasn't resurrected himself at all. At all. If he's gonna uh, resurrect himself, he should uh, get on with it. Come in. Everyone is welcome here. Drink, dance, and forget the Anui of this day. The Anui. I'll never forget the Anui of the day. Ever. All right. I'm thinking Ragnar is at the other town in this area, though. Unless I'm mistaking the name of the places around here. The woman in here can't get enough of me. It's great. Or the women. Pardon, mademoiselle. I am busy with these gentlemen at the moment. Come back later. He should only last another 20, maybe 30 seconds. Ooh la la, the entourage. I'm not that kind of girl, mademoiselle. You must come alone. Oh. She thought we were going to run a train on her ass? I mean, I brought all females, okay? There was a lovely young girl called Blondell who used to rent this room. You know, I hear she's living happily elsewhere now. Or somewhere else now, rather. That's cool. Oops, did not mean to go back upstairs. Okay, so I want to make it daytime here. Do I need to rest? Eh, probably not. But I'll do it anyways just to make it daytime, I guess. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh? Oh? Who's that fuckface? Hello? Was that too fucking... Oh, I, w I wasn't able to go back here last time. I remember now. Do you think the Marquis Regent will be angry? Because I did manage to take Blondel to Le Palais like he ordered, I mean. Yes, he'll be hopping, but won't he? You can't tell anyone you found me hiding here. Please. 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 I'm gonna go down your well and fucking steal your shit then. Okay, there's no shit to steal. I don't even remember that guy, but whatever. All right, let's make it daytime, and then we'll take a look around in the daytime in this area. Maybe check the shops and see what they sell here now, if it's any different. This is the city of song and dance, La Zephyr. The town north of here has been named Obodemon. So that's not the place I'm looking for either. I'm trying to remember where that Leon whatever place was at. The Place de Leon. I'll find it eventually. I don't need to be told if anyone is wondering. I'll figure it out. Surely there will be a slot tonight. Surely Artois will let me have a bass on stage. Gotta make it successful. Otherwise, my dad will think I'm just messing around here in the big city. Pub will not be opening till the evening. Came over here as the oceans, and you will have zero. Yes. Yeah, they sell all the garbage that we've already had. Nothing new here, then. Double checking. Yep, all the garbage. We don't need any of that garbage. It's all garbage. Shops do not change. At least not these ones. Did I check this well? Must have, because there's no shinies or anything down here. Da, da, da. That Tom Foolery's performance is the funniest thing I've ever heard. I've seen in a long while. I haven't stopped laughing since he arrived. There's a great comedian here at the moment called Tom Foolery. Head over to the theater in the evening if you want to catch a performance. Is he? Is this where he hangs out during the day? Cause I'll talk to him. Blondell escaped with the priest. Apparently, I hope they're both happy now, wherever they are. Still chuckling even now. He's hilarious. So hilarious. Do, 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 do. Okay, I guess we're done here then. 